Today has been designated by our bishops as the annual day of prayer for survivors and victims of human trafficking. It's the feast of St. Josephine Bakida, who was kidnapped as a child and sold into slavery. She died in 1947 and was canonized in the year 2000. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and here's what Pope Benedict wrote about St. Josephine Bakida on the first page of his encyclical letter about hope. To come to know God, the true God, means to receive hope. We, who have always lived with the Christian concept of God and have grown accustomed to it, have almost ceased to notice that we possess the hope that ensues from a real encounter with this God. The example of a saint of our time can help us understand what it means to have a real encounter with this God for the first time. I am thinking of the African, Josephine Bakita. She was born in Darfur in Sudan. At the age of nine, she was kidnapped by slave traders, beaten till she bled and sold five times in the slave markets. Eventually, she found herself working as a slave for the wife of a general, and there she was flogged every day till she bled. As a result of this, she bore 144 scars throughout her life. After this description of her suffering, Pope Benedict went on to tell how she ended up in Italy where she learned about Jesus, who, like her, also suffered from being scourged. Here's how he put it. Now she had hope, no longer simply the modest hope of finding masters who would be less cruel, but the great hope. She said, I am definitively loved, and whatever happens to me, I am awaited by this love, and so my life is good.